Hello there, everyone. My name is Tirza Ekholm, Tirza Ekholm, if we haven't met before. And uh, welcome to the Tirza Factor and another day in my art studio. And I just wanted to jump on here real quick because I'm moving forward in my sculpture idea. So when I ended the broadcast uh, yesterday, I talked about needing to um, fill up my cone uh, with materials. I think that I'm going to actually wait on that. I'm going to get this, the whole sculpture built, and then at the bottom I will add some weights and then perhaps put some felt there, and that way I can maneuver with the whole feet thing and everything else that's, that I intend to have going on. But first, I kind of want to stabilize um, my, little, my little wire skeleton here, so um, I'm hoping I can do this with a bit of tape. Um, if not, I'm going to try on something else. Um, I don't need it to be super, super... Um, well, let's see how we're going to go here. I just need it to not move too much while I pack, pack some of the, the, um, the first layer of form around it. So I'm going to give this a try. Um, and if I need to create something stronger, a stronger, safe, stable surface, then I will. So the last time I used a cone like this, actually, it didn't have anything soft on it like this thread. So it's kind of a departure from what I've done before. Uh, but how are you, how is everyone today? I hope you're out doing something fun and fabulous. Um, I myself have had a couple of very interesting days. I've been able to um, meet with people on the phone and... Um, and learn all kinds of fascinating, fun things with people. Um, uh, it's interesting where I get to go. I get to. I've been to recently. I've been to Chicago, and wow, well, where else have I been? I've met people from California, and I meet people in all industries. You know, I've met I've met other artists. It's so cool to find out what other artists are doing, um, what they're creating, how they're marketing their things. Um, the other thing, of course, is meeting lots of entrepreneurs um, who are, I mean, we're all um, looking for new ways to grow, not only in our lives, but in our businesses and what we're doing. Um, and that's the kind of thing that I'm trying to promote as well. So, um, oh, I think this is going to work just great. I've got, I've got her feet here now. Everything is a little bit more stable. So this is great. Um, I know she's a bit tall for trying to do it as a split camera, so I may not quite continue that, but eh, bear with me. And uh, let's see where we where are we gonna be able to take this thing. So just crumple the tin foil around where you want it to go. And I've already, I think I've already kind of well, of course, I've already arbitrarily decided this is the front. And um, I'm gonna give her a bit of a figure and also a base for where we're going uh, with this. So um, I don't know if people are interested in sculptures anymore. I think I've seen a few videos. I haven't seen a whole lot on textile sculptures, which I think is kind of interesting. It's a really, uh, it's a really cool form. I suppose in some respects, it's not that much different from uh, doing it um, with the clay. I've seen people making their forms and then putting um, clay uh, on top. Um, I myself like fabric. I, I started out as a textile artist and I'll probably just continue being a textile artist because there's just something just wonderful about the whole thing. I love, I love the textures, of course, and the colors and the forms you can create. And um, once I knew you could make sculptures, um, I just have to say, I was just uh, completely fascinated uh, with that whole idea. So with this, the trick here is to keep the arms, you want some substance, but you also kind of not want them to be too different. And, and so I don't need these to turn into a couple of wings here. Um, <laughs> that's always a kind of a fun thing. So let's just... We're going to see how far I'm going to take that. Right now, I'm kind of giving her a back and her neck. This is going to be her neck, and 
she gets to, I'm going to be using a ping pong ball, as I may have mentioned before. A ping pong ball is going to be her head. Uh, and then, of course, I'm going to use these really yummy silk fibers for her attire. So, um, yesterday I showed you some of the skeletal forms. I guess what I really didn't show you was, um, besides showing you the silk fibers, I didn't show you where I was really planning to go with this. Um, well, just uh, stay with me and you'll get a chance to see. So, I don't know about where you are, but where I am in beautiful Colorado, we have gorgeous weather. Um, it, it's just beautiful sunshine. You know, I think it's always beautiful here. It's just, I am so blessed to live in a place that's beautiful. Um, I just feel really blessed to be, to be in the company of people who are always growing and learning and have amazing things to offer other people. And um, truly is a, a wonderful privilege to meet people. I've met a couple of people recently from um, nonprofits, um, and it just um, impresses me so much when people from nonprofits are looking to to change the world. They have they have missions that they want to accomplish. Um, it's 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 amazing to me, and this is the kind of time where um, we all need something positive like that. That's why I try to post positive things on my page. I am not quite liking the way that's going yet so far. Um, I don't need to be too picky in this time because I'm going to be, I know I'm going to be adding other layers, but still. Ow. Here we go. So what are some of your favorite things to do? And if there's a nonprofit you like, then, you know, drop a comment in below and let me know what it is that you what you like to support, what it is you're wanting to change in the world. And if you're just if you're in business, then what is it you're wanting to accomplish in your business? How, when you go to bed at the end of the day and before you close your eyes, you know, how do you lean back and go, wow, you know, I had a really great day. This is what I got a chance to do. You know, for me, I get a chance to um, I get a chance to create uh, beautiful art. I get a chance to connect others. I love being a connector. Um, uh, and I love hearing people's stories, why it is that they do the things that they do. So um, in a few minutes, actually, uh, I'm going to be jumping on to a, a networking call. Another Zoom call, Another yet another networking. But this one is for uh, a network called Expand the Business. Um, and they're a very special group. We have a private Facebook group, and we've got, oh, I don't remember, a couple of thousand people? Of course, they're not all coming onto this call. I think the call that we're jumping on is going to be 30 to 50 people. And again, we're all businesses um, engaged in connecting with each other, seeing how we can help each other. And you know, of course, the best thing about business is not so much that, um, it's who you know and who you can connect to someone else. And I just find the whole process fascinating. So I think I'm going to need one more thing. And that's going to be, well, hold on. You know, this is probably not the most interesting thing yet um, uh, to happen. But the thing is, is we're setting the foundation for what's going to happen next. So let me see if I can give her a bit of a neck. Um, and then I think the next time we connect, I will have attached her head, which is a, believe it or not, yes, it is a ping pong ball. So, uh, hey, drop a, drop a comment or two in the, in the, drop a line below if this is, if you are liking this, if you want to know more about it, or if you just want to know more about connecting with others, nonprofits, businesses in general. I love getting together with people, learning what they're about, um, and connecting them. So again, my name is Tirza Ekholm of the Tirza Factor. And today, um, thanks for being on with me as I created the next layer for my 
sculpture. There's going to be more to come. There's actually more layers to come um, before we get to do the probably the more fun stuff of the, the silk fibers and the glow-in-the-dark paints. Have a fabulous day and go help somebody else have a fabulous day. Be well.